everyone welcome to my channel in today's video i want to share with you how to crochet a um, willow square just like that and i'm using 100 percent cotton yarn but you can use uh, um, yarn what you prefer and i'm using a 3.5 millimeter hook crochet hook and yeah let's start so we are starting off with a slip knot and then we are doing four chain one two three four and we are going in the first chain and do a slip knot to close the ring so now we are doing three chain one two three and this count as our first double crochet and in this ring we are going in we are doing um, 50 more double crochet so this count as one and in total we do have to have um, 16 um, double crochet in the uh, round in the first round so this is the first one and now I'm doing 15 more double crochets in the middle of the ring so two and three and I meet you at the end Now I have made six, 16 um, double crochet in the round and to close the round we are going in the first double crochet in the third um, chain and do a slip knot to close the round and now we are doing three double crochet, uh, three chain, sorry, turn our work and do um, one double crochet in the first stitch from the first round. One chain, one double crochet in the next stitch, one chain and one double crochet in the next stitch and you continue to do that until the end and I will meet you there. So now you must have um, 16 of these double crochet and to close the round you go in the first double crochet in the third chain and do a slip knot then you chain one two three and turn our your work and what we are doing next is um, this count as a first double crochet and we are going in these in the middle of the first um, uh, place here and do two double crochet in here one two and one double crochet in the stitch of the first on the top of the first um, double crochet and here is an open space and we are doing two double crochet in the middle of the space and one double crochet uh, on the top of the first uh, stitch of the double crochet from the first uh, from the second round also two double crochet in the middle of the space here and one double crochet on top of this double crochet from the first from the second round so do this until the end and i will meet you there so now we are at the end of the row and we are doing two double crochet in the last um open space here 
And to close the round, we are going on the first double crochet and the third stitch chain and close the round with a slip stitch. So now we are starting with the um, next round and we are chain six, three, four, five, six, chain, turn our work and this um, round is a little bit um, special so you have to keep attention so what we are doing next is we do a single crochet in the third um, stitch from the previous row. One, two, three. One single crochet and now we are chain one, two, three and we are going in the third stitch of the previous row. One, two, three in here to a single crochet Then we chain four, one, two, three, four, and we do the same. We go in the third stitch, one, two, three, do a single crochet. And now we are chain three, one, two, three, and we go in the third stitch, do a single, single crochet. So this is the first one, five, three, four, three, and we do this again and again until the end. Uh, um, so we start again with one, two, three, four, five, and we go in the third one, one, two, three, and do a single crochet in here. And now we are chain three, one, two, three, do a single crochet in the third one. Now we are chain four, one, two, three, four, oops, and do a single crochet in the third one, one, two, three. And we are chain three, one, two, three, do a single crochet in the third one, in the third stitch of the previous row. And now we are start again, one, two, three, four, five, and in the third one a single crochet. Now one, two, three, oops. Sorry for the noise. So this is five. Now we have three. And here single crochet. Five, three, four. One, two, three, four. Going in the third one. And okay, this yarn is special. <laughs> Um, four, yes, now we do three, one, two, three chain, and we do the same and go in the third stitch, do a single crochet, and now we start again, one, two, three, four, five, and we go in the third stitch of the previous one, do a single crochet, and one, two, three, do a single crochet in here and now we are chain one, two, three, four, do a single crochet in the third one and now one, two, three is our last one and we are slip stitch in here. And do a slip stitch in the first round here. <clears throat> so this is what it has to look like. And now, um, 
So now we are starting with the fifth row and uh, to do that we are chain three, one, two, three. And in the first chain here of five, we are do five more double crochet. Three, four, five. <clears throat> Sorry, so we have in total um, five double crochet. This first one counts as a double crochet. As a one, two, three, four, five. In the first five chain, now we chain two, one, two and do five double crochet in the same space. Two, three, four. So now we have five double crochet, and then the next chain, three chain from the previous row, we do a single crochet, and in the next four chain from the previous row, we do seven double crochet, and this will be a little shelf. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And in the next one, we are do a single crochet. And for the next corner, we do the same. We do um, in the five um, chain from the previous row, um, the same like this, um, four double crochet, two chain, four double crochet. So we're starting off with four double crochet to create the corner. Also four double crochet, two chain and four double crochet and now we see you at the end. So now we are doing our last single crochet to close the round. We are going in the third double crochet of the first um, and the third um, chain of the first double crochet and do a slip knot. So and this is our little flower. So chain one, turn the work, slip stitch in the previous, oh sorry, slip stitch in the single crochet from the previous row, just like that. And now we chain six, one, two, three, four, five, six, and we are going in the fourth stitch from the previous shell, one, two, three, four, and we do a single crochet in here. And then we chain three, one, two, three, and do a double crochet in the um, single crochet from the previous row. Now we chain four, one, two, three, four, and we do a single crochet in the corner of the previous row.
chain two and another thing a single crochet in the same corner now we chain four one two three four and we do a double crochet in this single crochet from the previous row Now we chain three, one, two, three, and two in the um, little shelf here from the previous row in the fourth stitch, a single crochet, chain three, do a double crochet in these single crochet, chain four, one, two, three. Four, and now we are coming to the next uh, corner we do in this corner one single crochet two chain one single crochet and four chain one double crochet in this single crochet from the previous row so, and this is what you are going to continue and I, I will see you in, uh, at the end. Now we are at the end of the row, <coughs> sorry, and we are stitch, um, a slip stitch in the third chain of the um, first chain um, row. So this is what we are going to do. And now we are starting the next round. We are chain three, one, two, three. Turn our work and <clears throat> do four more double crochet in this space. So now we have five, the first one counts as a double crochet, five double crochets and in this tiny space here from the previous row we are going to double crochet three, one, <coughs> two and three, chain two. And in the same tiny space, three double crochet. One, two, oh, sorry, I have to pause here because I have uh, some trouble with my yarn. I have some trouble with my yarn here. I have a knot. So, sorry for that one. <laughs> um, three double crochet for the corner. So, I did three double crochet in the small corner, two chain, three double crochet. And now we are due in the next chain from the previous row, five double crochet. One, two, three, four, and five, <clears throat> sorry, and in these small um, chain spaces we are do three double crochet. and in another space also three double crochet and 
And now we are coming to the next corner. We do here five double crochet in the space. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five. And now we are coming to the next corner and we do in this tiny um, space um, again three double crochet, two chain and three double crochet and do the same um, <clears throat> the same thing like that. Um, yeah, and I will see you at the end of so now we are at the end of the row. Three, three double crochet in here <clears throat> and then we are going in the first um, double crochet chain in this chain three and do a slip stitch just like that chain one turn our work and do our last round of the willow square and this is looks like that we do a single crochet in the next stitch from the previous row and in the next stitch a single crochet and a next single crochet in the next stitch and we do this until we came we are coming to the corner the last row is um just thing single crochet to make um to make the square um nice and pretty so now we are coming to the corner so this is the corner and here we are doing in this corner two um, single crochet just like that one chain and in the, in the same corner two single crochet and continue doing single crochet in the stitch from the previous row in every stitch just like that and this is what you are do for the corner just two uh, single crochet one chain and two single crochet and I will meet you at the end so now we are at the end of the row and we are slip stitch in the first single crochet make a slip knot and cut the yarn so you have to cut the yarn and now we have, have finished our willow square, um, willow square, not granny square. So this is what it looks like. So now you have to cut the yarn, um, um, weave this in and yeah, that's it. I hope it was helpful and I will see you in the next video.